Special Olympics has been helping empower people with disabilities through sport. And this weekend in Bloomington is no different. More than 400 athletes are playing at the Shirk Center on Illinois Wesleyan's campus to show just how awe-inspiring teamwork can be. WMBD Scott Preps shares this story. They've been scrimmaging and playing basketball games uh, since October. So their season is uh, kind of just starting to reach its uh, pinnacle. It's a tradition 40 years in the making. A basketball tournament designed to bring players closer through competition. Bring it down with Leroy. Play on the right side. The game of basketball is Jordan Beard's passion. Because I have a basketball hero, it's Michael Jordan, I just want to be like him. But this game isn't one his mother was sure he could play. This is one of his only opportunities to get out and get to participate in an event like this. Special Olympics has made sure that Jordan and other athletes like him with physical and cognitive disabilities are able to make this court their own. He loves it. It has made him a different person. You can just see that he's more outgoing. This gives him an outlet to be out with peers of his own age and to be with his friends. This week, the Shirk Center is hosting 36 teams from as far away as Macomb and Kankakee. One, two, three, two. These athletes have spent months practicing. So when the ball is tipped, they're ready to go. A lot of it is social, as they get to be with their friends, they get to meet friends and just hang out with them and have fun. With each bucket, they're bonding. And with each assist, they're learning more about themselves and what they can do through hard work and commitment to the game. Good job, guys. Because every missed shot isn't a foul. It's an opportunity to learn, laugh, and have fun. And that's a slam dunk for any athlete. In Bloomington, Scott Prepst, WMBD 31 News. Teams that receive a gold medal at this tournament will advance to the state tournament in March. And if you want to get involved in the Heartland Area Special Olympics as an athlete, a volunteer, or a coach, you can visit our website for more information, and that's 